Hi, so what I got here is one of these dome lights and what I'm trying to do is remove the glass so I could replace the bulb. So it's not very obvious how that is done because they're basically a screw list here. So what you're gonna do, it's all about grip. So the problem with what I have here is when I rotate it, the base also rotates. So what you need is something with grip, mainly something that is rubber here. So I have these utility gloves and they have the rubbery grip on them. You could also use anything that's tacky. So for example, even shelf liner. So I often use shelf liner to get grip on uh, jars, for example, jar lids. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna take these gloves and then rotate the glass and the base opposite ways. So let me go ahead and show you that. So I'm gonna put one hand and hold the base and because I have the tackiness here, I could hold it. And then the other hand, I am gonna rotate it counterclockwise. So I could actually also try to do this with one hand since I'm holding the uh, camera. Um, and what I'm gonna do in my case, because I can't, because I'm holding the camera, I can't actually grip the base. What I'm gonna do is push up to hold the base in place and then I am going to twist the glass. Hold the base in place, twist counterclockwise, and you see how it's loosened. And it's just gonna come off. So, so you see how now it's loosened like that. You know, just keep on rotating it. And I'm gonna... And so, so I rotated it off uh, counterclockwise. And what I wanna show you is the mechanism that keeps it on. So you'll see that the glass here is indented in. And so that's where there are nubs on the frame that actually uh, sticks into these edges. So let me show you that. So often what you see is you'll have these three of these that holds it in place when you rotate. So there's one here, one here, and it's triangular. Another one right here. So once you twist it counterclockwise and it rotates it to the empty places, you could just it just comes off. But just keep on rotating it counterclockwise. So to put it back on, I am gonna line the edges. You can see I have three edges indented in. I am gonna put it right next to those nubs and I am just gonna rotate. So I'm just gonna keep on rotating clockwise until it locks in place. And you can see now it's locked in place. You know, it's not gonna come off, just test it out, make sure it doesn't come off. And uh, that's really it. That's how this mechanism dome light works and I hope this helps and please subscribe and thank you for watching.